Hey everybody, just because you have lactose intolerance doesn't mean that you can't eat lactose. What is lactose intolerance? It's when you have digestive symptoms after you eat foods that have lactose, which is the naturally occurring sugar found in something like milk. Lactose is a disaccharide. It comprises of two monosaccharides, glucose and galactose. Uh, lactose needs to break these two molecules down into two in order to be absorbed into the small intestine. Uh, so our cells, organs, and tissues can use lactose for energy. The lactase enzyme needed to separate glucose and galactose is made in the small intestine. If someone doesn't make enough of it, lactose uh, malabsorption can occur, which leads to lactose intolerance. So what happens? Well, it didn't get absorbed, right? So the lactose is going to continue down the digestive tract and wind up in the large intestine. This can cause more water to be drawn into the lumen or the empty space in the large intestine. Uh, that lactose will also be used as food as your, for your gut microorganisms. And these things can lead to urgency, diarrhea, gas, bloating, and abdominal pain. But don't worry yet, because the amount of symptoms you experience depends on how much lactose you eat and how much lactase your body makes. Like no two people are the same. And you may be able to tolerate lower lactose foods and even ones that have higher amounts if your portions are the appropriate size. So see below for foods that are low in lactose and dairy foods that have no lactose. Keep in mind, you can also use, um, there are enzymes out there, so you can enjoy all lactose foods and those in higher quantities. You just have to make sure that you're taking them in the right amount and at the right time. So make sure you talk to your gastroenterologist or your GI expert dietitian.